Hello. Hello. We are here with Frizzle Box. This came recently, right? Yeah. Yes. Yesterday or the day before? I think yesterday I got the email about it. Um, so, what do we have? This should be the postpartum box. Yes, it is. So postpartum Prego box. This should be our last box from Prego box. Dun, 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 dun. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, it's got a QR code. Mm. Oof. That smells like bully sticks. Yeah, well, that's what happens. Well, I want to see what this QR code is. Now? Yeah. Okay. We can't wait to see your unboxing. Take us at Prego box CA. Well, we've been doing lots of unboxings. <laughs> Booyah. You can watch them all. <laughs> okay. We got some raspberry rooibos from Acquired Taste Tea Company. That's where the decaf lemon cream was from. Oh. I had the decaf lemon cream yesterday. Kylie said, where's it from? I said, I don't know. That's where it's from. That it was in a brown bag. I was correct. Yeah. I couldn't remember. You could argue. You could be like, that's not brown. That's vanilla. No, vanilla is a little more orangey. Agree, disagree. Okay. Okay. Anyway. So. Raspberry leaf is supposed to help with contractions. Yes. Uh, and this can apparently stimulate uh, breast milk production as well as help contract the uterus. Good. Awesome. Great. Yeah. Next. Oh, nice. Speaking of. Reusable nursing pads from Mother and Nature oh. CA. Oh boy. Help prevent breast milk leaks and protect clothing stains. Machine washable. The pineapples. Oh, very nice. They're great. I bought some from Little Helper. Pineapples? No. <laughs> um, breast pads. Ah, uh, yeah. But these look, these look great too. Yep. The cotton flannel. And mixed fiber fleece. So fleece on this side and flannel on this side. Nice. Thank you, thank you, Prego Box. This is useful. Useful stuff. <laughs> if you've watched our Bunk to Mom video. Which will come out yesterday. So go go back and watch it. Oh nice. Dark. Perfect. Studio 36 nipple butter. Made with shea butter and calendula. Infused to soothe and heal sore nipples from Studio 36 Body. It smells decent too. Yes, it does. Kind of chocolatey. Yeah. Definitely, definitely smells like shea butter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it has co cocoa in it as well. Hi, cocoa. cocoa. Seed butter. Did you hear your name, Coco? It's got coconut oil. They spelled calendula wrong. Calendula. That's how I said it. Oh, don't, don't burp uh, at me. Avocado oil, shea butter, cocoa butter, or cocoa seed butter, beeswax, and choco pearl. Which I think is vitamin E. I don't remember. Okay. Useful. Booyah. Pringle box. What are you doing? <laughs> Not for you. Don't drop that in there. Don't ah, do. Wait, before I do this. Oh. Nice. <laughs> you could never have enough of those. Don't is we? <laughs> this is a stainless steel tea strainer from Prego Box. It comes in every box. Yes, it does. And you know what? Love it. <laughs> Keep it up. Strainers all day, every day. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing. If you lose your strainer from a previous box, yeah. they always send you a new one. Yeah, it's great. So, no, we love it. Makes it. sense. We love it. Uh, like, we started getting loose leaf teas and very quickly it was like, Ooh, we don't have enough. Now well, we have plenty. But now we do. But yeah. for a while, we didn't have very much. Did yeah. we, Coco? We don't care about our problems. <laughs> What's this? Folia Mom. Soothing perineal foam. Ah, soothe the perineal area. Spritz foam directly on postpartum pad. Do we have a postpartum? Oh. <laughs> Things I'm going to learn. Okay. Ah. Uh, it says, crafted with centuries-old go-to oils for po Faux postpartum. For postpartum, this foam is heaven and the perfect way to soothe. How did you pronounce it? Because I can never remember. Wait, what? Calendula? No. Per Perineal. Perineal? That's, what, that's how I pronounce it. I don't know. That area. Yes. It's just, like, it's escaped my brain. 
Okay, cool. Ah, yeah, it's got lots of good stuff in it. Promise, first test it on ourselves and our babes. No yucky ingredients, no colorants, no synthetics, no fillers, no sneakiness. Very good. Uh, you can barely see that. But this is good. Practical. Love it. Me too. Um, A muslin swaddle blanket from Baby Knit Yeg. That's what it says. Baby uh, Knit underscore Y E G, I think. Oh, okay. This is just their Instagram that I that I have. So it's not their full business name, it's their Instagram. Stop that. Well, it's not the same thing. No, 100 that, that makes more sense than what I had. It's just Baby Knit Yeg. Uh, multi purpose use. Can be used as a swaddle, washcloth, car seat, and stroller cover. Okay, I thought it said car, <laughs> car seat. seat. And for like, what? Hey, we finally installed our car seat. Made for babies' sensitive skin. Interesting, because it's pretty scratchy. I guess maybe, maybe with washing, maybe it'll it's get for softer. sensitive skin to make it less sensitive. <laughs> like this will get you used to life. I don't know. <laughs> Sounds like something my parents would have done. Here's your Brill Pad pillow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And finally. Anyways, also useful. Yes, everything in here, except for this, is useful. That's useful too. Okay, we all need energy. Did, what did the doula say? Don't you remember? She said, Tony, when the baby's born, I'm going to take care of everything. And you can be at the bar for all I care. She said, have snacks. Oh, I have to make them. I have to make them. <laughs> Me. I will make them. I thought these are actual already So did made. I, actually. I was excited to try one right now. This, <laughs> this is a chocolate chip energy bite mix from Goodness Bombs. The perfect snack for a new mama who needs a boost of energy. Make your own fresh energy bites in just five minutes and one to two ingredients you have at home. Interesting. What are the ingredients? Milk? Um, you need this mix, nut butter and honey or maple syrup. That's easy. Or if you are allergic or don't like nut butters, then, then you can you're use, screwed. no, instead of nut butter, you can use a liquid which could be applesauce, mashed banana, or yogurt, for example. Cool. Yeah. I'm okay. excited to try these. Yep. So, yeah, you will be, or I'll be making them. Who said it's like when the Amish women go into labor, they start making bread? Huh. So maybe I'll make some bread. Energy bites. My mind off of things, and then I get to eat them. Mm. Mm. Okay, this is great. Yeah. I don't think anything's not useful. Nope. This is a pretty good box. It's a very good box. Canadian. Yes. From Alberta, I think. Alberta. Um, Alberta. And, and good customer service. They've been checking yeah. in periodically. Oh, have they? Yep, they have. I only knew about the one time. Yeah. Asked us if we needed anything in our box. Yeah. No. Um, highly recommend. For those looking for a pregnancy. For a more uh, practical pregnancy box. Like totally. if, if you don't like the branded you go mom and you want stuff that's more useful, You go dad. <laughs> then I would rec I recommend Prego Box. Although I have been using these slippers much to Tony's chagrin. Um, they've kind of flattened already. This is true. They he make hates less them. Yeah, because they fall off my feet. They don't fit feet quite right. So no, they're they're like uh, they're like this when they should be like this. Well, they should just be. Your foot should be able to go into it straight on, but yeah, it ends things. up at an angle. Yeah. So like on this side, it's worn out here, and there's nothing on this side. Anyways, I've been using them. That's from the bump to mom. Anyway, that's all. Bye. Goodbye.